Jerry, thanks for taking the time. And uh, let's talk about how educated your team is. 11 members of your team, an MPSF all, uh, all academic team. I think that's quite a lot. Very, very good uh, portion of the team. So I would say one third of the team in that uh, got that honor. That's pretty good uh, spot where we stand. And we have few also just missed it by that much. So I'm very, very proud. We're not just excelling on the f on the strip or in the fencing side, but also excelling academically. So very proud of these guys. Your last event of the year is coming up this weekend. Uh, Army and Navy coming to town to take them on. Kind of a whole day of events going on with Air Force fencing. Kind of tell me what's going to happen. It will be a long day, as you said. So we start the day by competing against Army and Navy. The we are out of the NCAA uh, season. However, we're just keeping that ritual that we always fence the three service academy against each other. It's fun for us. It's fun, fun for our cadets. Uh, we get to compete against them, exchange culture, and most importantly, get that fencing competition going between the service academy. So it should be fun for us. That event will start at 8.30 through noon. So we're just going to fence against each other. Um, NCAA style the competition uh, will be and then after this we will have our alum coming uh, and we'll do our alum reunion and uh, we'll have a alum fencing competition as well so we'll have our our alums suit up and fence if they want I'm not going to force anyone and then uh, later on the day or in the evening we'll have our team banquet at the Eisenhower Golf Course. That is a lot going on. Talk to me, though. Uh, do your cadets get up for this? I mean, I know the NCAA season's over, the championships are over, but uh, taking on their rivals from the service academy, do they get really excited? Absolutely, yeah. It's Again, at the end of the day, it's a fun competition. It's an important thing to go out there and to compete against these uh, service academy. It's where all have the same mindset. We're all coming from the same background, and it's fun just to put on the fencing suit and uh, fence. So for them, I'm sure it will be fun and I'm sure it will be a great experience for the, our cadets. Definitely fun for them to also win the day. So we'll see what we'll do. It'll also be the final competition for three seniors, three members of your team. You're going to honor them. Uh, talk to me a little bit about those three. Uh, so we have three seniors graduating in a couple of months. Uh, Matthew Hahn, Amy Kang, and Kyle Villacorta. The three uh, actually will be uh, Space space Force officers. So congrats to, to them. I'm very, very excited and very, very um, honored to work with this class. They have a special uh, place in my heart because this is their uh, senior year and it's my fourth year. So this is the first, uh, the first full class for me. So I'm very, very excited for them. Can't wait to, uh, to attend the senior ceremony and see them getting honored uh, by the, our AD, Nate Pine, and our superintendent, uh, General Clark. Talk to me about what it's like having all the alumni back, some alumni back that come back. Is How important is it that alumni like see what's happening in your program and support? Huge, of course. Uh, this is something that we haven't done before. So we're doing the first uh, alumni reunion, alumni fencing reunion. We haven't done this. We usually invite the alums to the banquet and hope they will come. We have uh, some good turnouts, some years, but this year we designated that event and we said we will try to do that every three years. And the uh, alum event will always uh, al align with the uh, Tri-Service Academy when we fence Army and Navy at Yosefa. So hopefully we'll tag along and we'll make a, a cool experience for, all, uh, for all our alum. And it will be very uh, fun to see our alums bonding and uh, having fun with our cadets so I'm, I'm excited for that as well yeah should be a lot of fun omar thanks for taking the time and have a great time this weekend thank you brian go falcon